Hi folks, Cameron here for Kingsbury Travels, Cameron's Pantry, and we're going to be reviewing a Takis product. This is Takis Guacamole. There's the thumbnail shot right there. <laughs> Unfortunately, uh, well I did kind of do uh, another uh, different version of this, which was the Tahin ones, uh, the three packages, the three snack packages that I had for those. And those were actually really, really good. I thought, well, why not do a Takis variety? So this is going to be the first one that I picked up. It's only a 10 servings per container, about 12 pieces for about one ounce serving size. And it's 140 calories per serving. There's uh, 220 milligrams of sodium, kind of low. 17 grams of carbohydrates, one, is one gram of dietary fiber, no sugars, no added sugars, two grams of protein, two. Uh, but has a lot of corn stuff in it. There is no avocado. It's an artificially flavored avocado. Uh, the reason being is that avocados are pretty expensive and with stuff like this, this would actually cost, if it had actual avocados in it, it would cost well over $3. Yeah. So unfortunately, we just have to uh, make do with corn masa flour, along with a lot of vegetable oil in it and uh, MSG, tomato powder, citric acid, onion powder, garlic powder, um, a lot of natural and artificial flavors, which they don't really say. But there is yellow number five, blue number one, red number 40. Yes, it has dyes in it. So we're gonna be trying this. This is by Bimbo. And it's made in Mexico by uh, Barcel USA. And you can check them out on www.barcel-usa.com. So let's check this out, shall we? Okay, these are very unusual. They're not like regular tortilla chips. They're rolled up. Here. If you can see that, it's all rolled up. It's a rolled up tortilla. Mm. It's very hard. Very crunchy. Not bad. It still has that flavorful kick of guacamole. Although it's artificial. Very crunchy, but an unusual texture to me. I normally like traditional tortilla chips, but these aren't half bad. Can definitely plow through 12 pieces as a snack. Only eight grams of saturated fat. No, correction. Only eight grams of total fat. 2.5 grams saturated fat, no trans fat. Three grams polyunsaturated fat and 2.5 grams monounsaturated fat. I got these at a, a local shop here. And they're not bad. 
mild taste to it, even though it still has that flavorful guacamole kick to it. I would probably recommend this once in a while. But I would opt to go for chips that have actual guacamole in it. It'll be expensive, yes. It will be a little more expensive, but it would be worth it. Because you want really good, smooth, natural guacamole, uh, which has just a little bit of mayonnaise mixed into it. So, this is Cameron the Farmer for Kingsbury Travels, Cameron's Pantry. Until next time.